I have represented victims of car accidents with semis and other big trucks for over 35 years. These accidents could have been avoided. Each week, I will share a tip on how to make the roadway safer. These involve steps that need to be taken by semi drivers, car drivers, as well as trucking companies. My safety tip this week is inadequate parking for truckers. As we all know, and we can tell by driving on the highways and interstate, there's a lot of truck traffic. And because of the economy that we have and because of the instant gratification people want, they want to order something and have it delivered tomorrow, there's going to be more and more semis on the highways delivering goods. Well, the problem is in order to have safe drivers on the highway, we've got to allow them to stop and park and rest and comply with the Federal Motor Carrier Safety Regulations on hours of service. However, we don't give them enough parking spaces to do that. So truck drivers have to continue past their hours of service because they look and there's no place to park. They go by our truck stop and it's full. They go by a rest area and it's full, so they keep driving. Sometimes truckers have to drive in bad weather, snow, sleet, ice, and they normally would pull off and they're required by the Federal Motor Carrier Safety Regulations, industry standards, CDL manuals. They're required to stop but they have no place to stop. Some states are horrible. Illinois and Ohio are two of the worst. South Dakota and North Dakota are the two of the best, but there's a lot of states throughout this country that do not have enough parking for truck drivers along interstates. So it's a problem that we all need to focus on. The truck driver, the trucking company, the folks that share the highways with the truckers. The government should encourage through tax breaks or incentives to the private sector to build more locations where truckers can safely park. Private enterprise should be involved. Truck stops should be involved. State and county governments, the rest areas need to be expanded so that there's more available truck parking. We do not want the truckers sitting along the exits and entrance ramps. We want to give them safe places to park where they can rest and they can drive their truck safely.